Hello, this is a special video. This isn't a tutorial. Um, I'm going to be checking out Scratch 2.0. If you don't already know, Scratch 2.0 is the latest version of Scratch. It's literally just come out. Um, we've been waiting for this for many years, um, two or three. Um, that was when it was first announced. And they finally released a prototype, an alpha. Um, and I'm very excited for it. And I've just got home from school. And I'm going to check it out. Okay, so um, I've taken a look at it now. Um, I like it, um, but it's very, very buggy. That's one of the things that um, I'd have to say. It's very buggy. And um, one of the things is I've been just experimenting with a project to do with cloning. And I came up with this bug um, that clones, um, when they say something and they, um, you know, uh, the the project works that when you press the red the red um, stop button, all the clones are automatically deleted, but that's caused a problem because <laughs> the speech bubbles haven't been deleted. So this is an early project I've just made um, that showcases cloning, um, trying and <laughs> the, the speech bubbles. I can get rid of them, um, but if if you imagine they're not there, then <laughs> there's the scratch cat and he's saying press space, so you do, and all these clones are created, and they keep coming, and these are all from one sprite, bear in mind, and then they dance in the background, so that's pretty cool, <laughs> bear in mind, this is this sprite here is the only one on the, that actually exists, and the rest of them are just him being cloned, so that's one of the projects I made, um, as you can see they all got deleted, and yeah, so um, it's good. I'll I'll definitely be looking at this again. I think I'll be making another one of these videos um, about Scratch 2.0, maybe showing off something else um, that's cool about it tomorrow. But for now, this this was this is cloning. So I've shown you cloning. I wish this video could have been a bit better because the um, it's just. The only thing is the speech bubbles are a bit random, but if you try and ignore them, you'll see what the project's all about. It's about these things in the background, and they, despite being not actually sprites, just being um, clones, they can do all these amazing things, um, <laughs> and it opens up a whole new range of possibilities for Scratch. And even though, if you're watching this, you might be new to Scratch, I hope you can appreciate that, and hopefully you'll be using Scratch 2.0 in the future. Okay, so, thank you. Um, I've got more tutorials coming out, obviously this wasn't one of them, this is just a quick look at Scratch 2.0, and I'll be coming, I think, I'll probably be coming back to Scratch 2.0, covering new things, because there's, um, also, the other features are you got cloning, which I showed you there. You can see some of the scripts here. I'm not going to explain them. You've also um, you've got cloud data. Okay, so briefly, um, they're things that they're variables that you can store on the internet. Before you'd have to just have them locally, and when you um, exited a project, then the variable would reset, which was kind of a bummer. Um, but now you can have actual high scores and stuff um, so that's another thing I'll probably be covering um, it's new what else the more blocks feature you can now make blocks and you can program block blocks and I had a look at that briefly and it's that's really cool and yeah I think they're the main things I'll be covering also there's a thing about a webcam where you can basically um, you know, you can uh, get your webcam and you can be making games with your webcam, so <laughs> maybe that's something else that I'll be checking out. Where is that? Ah, video motion on stage. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I won't do that now. Okay, so um, thank you, and I hope you've enjoyed this video. Look out for more of these, but also look out for more tutorials. I'll be releasing both. Um, obviously, the um, they're only releasing the alpha, um, of Scratch 2.0 for until the 21st. Um, I'm releasing this on the 17th. So I've got limited time to make these videos, but I'll try and make a few more for you guys.
Um, but yeah, um, thank you, and I hope to see you again.